Oh hi, thanks for watching my video. So today we are playing with the Sim who has sort of fallen from grace. This is my Sim, her name's Jackie. She's had uh, quite a privileged upbringing. Her parents were pretty well known in the style influencer fashion career. Grew up very wealthy, didn't really have any want or need for anything. However, recently it all came crashing down. Turns out Jackie's parents weren't really that honest. And they're currently now both serving time in prison for tax fraud. So Jackie's just kind of been left on her own, you know, from being in a position to get everything she wants. And now she's left with nothing. Well, nothing except the kindness of her best friend. Jackie does have a best friend called Hallie. Hallie's a little bit more down to earth. She didn't grow up with the same sort of privileges that Jackie did. She lives in a slightly rougher part of town. But seeing her best friend fall on hard times, Jackie and her parents, Juliet and Brian, kind of stepped it up. They didn't really have much to offer, but they did have this space in their basement that they kind of, well, I, I want to say renovated, but I mean, it is sort of still a shithole, but they did do everything they could, you know, to try and make it as comfortable as possible. She's got some old attic furniture in here. But for now, this is as good as it's going to get. This is the place we call home. So we currently live in our best friend's family's basement. And Jackie kind of, she's still feeling pretty bitter about the whole, you know, tax thing. She doesn't really understand why her family should have to pay tax at all, really. So she's sort of on a mission to try and make a name for herself. This is an opportunity for Jackie because she's always had a passion for fashion. She's always liked the field of work that her parents were in. And this could actually be a good thing, you know, every cloud, silver lining. It's an opportunity for Jackie to make a name for herself and build her own name. So I currently have my sewing mod installed. I say my, I didn't make it. It's an Aussie and Miriam's mod. And we're going to be using this to put together some clothing pieces. Um, first things first though, I think I need to like buy, I've got to buy some materials, some fabric, buttons, thread and needles and zippers. We started off with 400 simoleons, I'm hoping that's enough to get all of our basic materials. Mm. This isn't a new mod by any means, I've used it for many videos before. If you like the look of it, I will link it in the video description. Although I will let you know, I'm currently having an issue, which I think might be because of a mod conflict, where my game sort of freezes if I press my Windows key and leave my Sims 4 screen. Which I suppose if you're not really like using a screen recorder, maybe you probably wouldn't have much reason to exit your game using the Windows key, but... Just a heads up, if you do use this mod, you might have a few issues if you momentarily, you know, put down your screen. Well, we all have to start somewhere. Let's go and practice on paper, build up our sewing skill. I can't actually remember whether this skill goes to level 5 or level 10. I don't remember. The last time I played was with this was when I used, I think her name was Lana. Her backstory was a little bit different, but I mean, the premise was kind of similar, trying to make a name for herself in fashion. But you know, as we all know, or most of us know, life isn't a sprint, it's a marathon, you know? We, we're gonna take stepping stones here. So stone one, you know, we're not dreaming about getting an empire right off the back. We are living in our friend's basement. So I think phase one might just involve just trying to get on our feet a little bit. Um, let's do some uh, pattern and design for a pink fedora. Is that a fucking vampire? Not today. Go home. How did you even... She just teleported in here. I think the game's confused as to where my front door is. Get out of it, Alana Thangs. I do like your outfit choice for today, but I'm busy. Yeah, so I think, obviously, we, we just got to get on our feet first. So I've set, you know, a pretty... Um, I mean, I wouldn't even say modest, because it is a bit of a challenging amount. I've set a goal for 20,000 simoleons. Um, I kind of came up with that because that's sort of the starting funds of any household. So that's kind of a good amount to have to start a life, you know, get a house of your own. So that's our goal. We want to try and earn about 20k while we're living in Hallie's basement, get to a place where we're not just depending on our friend and we're, you know, sort of providing for ourselves a little bit. And I'm hoping that using a sewing machine might be the best way of doing that. I can't even remember how much these pieces sell for. I think, if I remember correctly, the toddler dress sells for about 350 simoleons, but I don't remember the skill levels required for each of them. So I guess we'll just have to see how we get on. I know that this mod will punish you if you try and sew something beyond your skill level, but I don't know what is within my skill level. So let's try a toddler dress, and if we fuck it up, 
then um, we're going to have to lose some money and then buy more supplies. That's the gamble you take with this mod. If you try and sew something that your sim isn't good enough to sew, you're just going to lose all of those expensive buttons and fabrics and stuff and you'll have to buy more. But you know, hopefully, hopefully toddler dress is fairly basic. Hopefully we won't run into too many issues with this. I mean, she's currently looking like it's going well. Oh, did it work or did you break it? Oh, okay, I guess that was beyond her skill level. Okay, I am just gonna have you practice then. I'm just gonna have you continuously practice until we build our sewing skill. What's that mood buff there? Oh God, my fabric. Maybe it's the faulty machine. Maybe it's the lack of enough skill. Either way, my fabric is destroyed and I need to buy more supplies. It's so expensive. Oh, Jackie, we're not getting off on the right foot, are we? How are your needs? Oh, your needs are perfectly fine. Okay, I think let's just practice then until we need to fulfill your needs. We're not gonna make any money on day one, I don't think, but that's fine. Set ourselves up for the future. Sewing level two, we now have 15% chance of making a fashion statement piece. Practice makes perfect. Okay, so basically, until we like get a higher skill, we're, we're gonna fail a lot of, a lot of uh, designs. Hunger's getting a bit low. Maybe we'll wait until it goes a bit orange and then we'll get some food. Clean up that mess and we'll have a fruit salad. Don't have any cooking skill, but you can't really fuck up a salad, can you? Okay, and then once you're done on the John, we'll practice a bit more until the energy goes orange and then you've got such an odd sleeping pattern. It's 9 a.m. and you wanna go to bed. I think we might just have to take a nap. I don't want you being on a really odd sleeping pattern. We can now sew and the stakes are 50 to... Hallie wants to come over, yeah, okay. The stakes are 50-50 to making a fabulous wearable outfit. She wants to become best friends. Of course, I thought we were already best friends. Okay, so I'm thinking we might actually have a chance of, if, if we practice that toddler dress again, we might actually have a good chance of getting it right this time. Hey, I said Hallie could come down, not the whole fucking town. I'm assuming this is the welcome wagon. Yeah, it is, because all of these are neighbors. And Hallie's mum's turned up with some fruitcake. Well, I will let you hang around because um, I don't really want to spend my money on food. Oh, I think it might be working. Our very first, our very first piece made by us. Um, where did your mum go? Where's the fruitcake? Okay, well, you know what? My, um, my social need is getting kind of low anyway, so I could maybe use this opportunity to just no, gas with Hallie, level. fill up that need, take a nap, get back to sewing. I'm pretty sure if you sew some of the lingerie pieces, some of them are worth like three and a half grand ago. Oh, I, we love Hallie. Maybe if when we actually start to make a bit of money, maybe we'll take Hallie out for dinner to say thanks, giving us somewhere to live when we fell on hard times. I think let's go for a hug and express admiration. Oh. All right, well, I'm going to take a nap now, so I'm going to send you home. Should we just take a nap on the couch? All right, nice hanging out, Hallie. See you later. You know where the door is. Okay, yeah, we'll just sleep for a few hours. And then we will make... Right, so we've got a 50% chance of getting it right. We could try... Um, we could try a romantic dress. Oh, I guess we don't... You need to draw its design first. Oh, okay, that's fine, that's fine. I thought it was going to tell me I ran out of designs. I thought it was going to tell me I'd ran out of supplies. Okay, draw romantic dress. So the fact that being at sewing level three means that I have a 50-50 chance of getting it right, that kind of makes me think that maybe the max is level five for this skill, I think. Right, should we do it then? Should we see if we can make a romantic dress? Maybe gonna see if I can get like five items on my clothing rack and then I'll sell what I have. Unless I run out of supplies and then I'm just gonna have to sell everything anyway. Oh no. Oh, if, did you fuck it up again? Yeah, it looks like you did. Oh shit. Okay, let's do the toddler dress again. You need two fabric units, one zipper and thread bundle, so I just used up the last of my fabric. Shit. Okay, fine, fine. Um, let's just hype it up, sim talk it, simstagram, tweeze it, and then we'll just, we'll sell it on Plopsy. Oh, looks like a few sims are following Jackie. I wonder what would happen if the creation would be shared on Plopsy. Yeah, I wonder what would happen too, game. Ooh. Jackie just opened a Plopsy shop Soon the money will rain. Okay, well now I have the option to just sell on Plopsy. You're tired again. Maybe we should take another nap and then use the evening to maybe do a bit more sewing. I'm quite impressed actually. I didn't think we'd be able to sew anything today. I thought we'd have to spend the whole day just building up our sewing skill. 
but that's probably not a bad idea. I think what I might do, I've got some money for some supplies now and I don't really want to waste that. So when we wake up for our nap, we're just gonna practice, practice, practice. That was pretty good money for that toddler dress, but I want to make the romantic dress. Oh, actually, you know what I could do? Um, I could, if I take a thoughtful shower first oh, yeah. and then practice, <laughs> I kind of have a feeling that, oh, I kind of have a feeling that because this is like a creative skill, I reckon being inspired would probably help us build this skill a bit quicker. Oh, she's singing in the shower. Not building a singing skill though. That did not get you inspired. Okay, fine. Oh, it is actually quite late. It's after 10. And some of our other needs are pretty low. Sort of made the mistake of not giving us anything fun to do around here. Okay, well maybe what we'll do then is we'll just have a quick meal, we'll just have a late night cereal, late night shit, we'll go to bed and then see if I can find something fun for us to do when we wake up in the morning. But you know, day one, we made 46 simoleons, so we're up. Maybe, maybe you could play like a little game on your phone or something. That might bring you a little bit of joy. Don't slam the fridge door. Oh, grateful, Jackie. You're not a spoiled brat anymore, all right? You need to... Realise reality. You need to buck up, son. It's not all sunshine, rainbows and roses anymore, is it? No. Oh, and just like that, she's happy. Okay, just keep keep playing your games. Okay, fun is back in the green. So I guess I have to buy some more supplies. Um, I think what I was running low on was zips, fabric. I think I might have everything else. Right, let's do a... Let's do a toddler dress. And then maybe we'll try the adult dress again. Because if I make the toddler dress and then I fuck up the adult dress, then I at least have something I can sell. Level four. Jackie can now sew and the stakes are 50-50 of making a fabulous wearable outfit. Oh, okay. Okay, cool. Okay, well, let's give it another try. Let's try the romantic dress again. You need eight fabric, four zippers and six threads. Oh, so I don't have enough. Okay, threads and needles. Um, zippers. I, sh I should have enough after that. I should have enough fabric. Okay, let's see. Can I, can I make the romantic dress? Yes, I can. Okay. Hallie's in the mood for some retail therapy. Hallie, you you know my situation. I am broke as shit. That girl can be so out of touch sometimes. Oh, that's looking good. That's looking like a completed piece, all right. Okay. So let's make another toddler dress, just because that's a safe bet. No thank you, property owner. No thanks. I'm busy trying to build my life. So hopefully, if this goes well, I'll have three pieces that I can sell, and we might even, like, get over a thousand simoleons. That'll be our first thousand, and we'll be one twentieth of the way there. <laughs> okay, that went well. So let's sell all of these. <laughs> Unsuccessful sell. Unsuccessful sell. All right, fine. What if I sim talk all of them first then and then try and sell them? Oh, one of them sold for 990 simoleons. I didn't realize the romantic dress was worth that much. I might I might make that again. Another romantic dress. But I think I need some more supplies. Jackie, look at the state of this. Clean up after yourself. You don't have servants anymore. You have a crush. Go for it, girl. Go for it. It's looking like these cells are going to be successful now. Yeah, okay, good. Um, what should we try now? Oh, I already have done a design for a fedora, so that's what I'm going to sew next. Oh, yeah, I need to get supplies for everything. Okay, let's just buy one of everything, and then we should have enough to make whatever we want. Okay, let's make a fedora, and what could we do? I don't think we're good enough to do any of the, the underwear. Hmm, maybe we'll try a gown. We'll do the fedora, we'll do the gown, and we'll do another romantic dress. Oh, that looks good. You'd look pretty good in that, actually. So maybe when we start actually making some serious money from our designs, maybe we could make something for Hallie as a, as a, a thank you present. And then once you're done, maybe we'll just take care of your needs a little bit. Um, for lunch, I'd say let's go salad until we build up a bit more of our cooking skill. And then we will have a little chat to Hallie on the phone for social. Nearly cooking level two. So soon we'll be able to... There we go, cooking level two. So now we can be trusted to not burn our friend's family's house down. Okay, so we are going to make... Um, well, we're going to make the romantic dress anyway, but where was the... Oh, are you serious? I still don't have enough fabric. Okay, check supplies, check inventory. What do I have? Four units of fabric, thread and needles. So I need eight fabric units for the dress. 
Okay, so I think I need quite a lot of fabric. Okay, let's make our romantic dress and then we'll try, we'll take a gamble and see if we can do the gown. What's this mood buff? Following the code. Jackie is staying true to all her loved ones. Solid relationships are not built on lies and deceit. Oh, that's very true, Jackie. Right, I think we're on our way to sewing level five. So I guess we'll find out soon whether this is a 10 level skill or a five level skill. If my voice sounds different, by the way, it's because I'm on the arse end of a cold. It's on its way out, but it's a... Uh, might make me sound a little bit nasally or bunged up. Jackie can now sew and the stakes are 50-50 of making a fabulous wearable outfit. I feel like I've had that pop up for every single skill now, <laughs> but okay, fine. So what do I need to sew a gown? I'm guessing I don't have the materials needed for a gown. Do I? Oh, I do? Oh, okay. So this is a 10 level skill. So now I'm starting to think maybe we might fuck up this gown, but that's okay. You live, you learn. I guess we'll just see. Oh, actually, I think it is going to be successful. Getting a bit tired. Okay, so I think really when we take into account our needs, we're sort of looking at maybe like three pieces a day. But that's okay. That's fine. We can work with that. That's still like 1,500 simoleons a day. I think possibly maybe we could push for a bit more tomorrow, though. Maybe we'll see if we can increase our production day by day. So tomorrow, my goal is to make at least four pieces. Okay, we just sold the summer dress for 990. How much are we gonna sell the fedora for? I think it was like, it's either 350 or it's 500 for the fedora. 990 again, okay. I think I found this last time that the, the gown sold for the same amount as the summer dress but required a lot more supply. So I think summer dress is probably the way to go. I can use less fabric that way. But for now, I think let's just call it a night. We'll go get full, we'll go get some sleep. And then tomorrow, we're going to try and make four pieces. I have already built a little house for us. It's very bare bones. It only has the kind of stuff you find in like a new rental. So it just has a small kitchen and a bathroom. And I don't think Hallie's parents would be too happy about us taking their furniture, but it's okay because it's a starter home. It's only worth like maybe 11 or 12 grand. So if we make 20K, then we should have enough to like give ourselves the basics and furnish it ourselves. I have a cursed book. Okay, just mail away the cursed book. I can't be asked with this. For rent, you are not the star of this show. And then we'll get some cereal. Oh, we got 72 simoleons though for mailing back that book. Oh, okay, cool. I guess we are the star of the show. I guess they can be the star of the show if they're gonna give me some money. Okay, use the John, take a shower, maybe go for a thoughtful shower. Now I know it's like early, it's only 10 a.m. So it's not really the best time for it, but We've got low social and low fun, so I'm thinking let's get Hallie and go do some karaoke or something. That might put us in a better mood. And we could do a cheeky bit of skill building as well. Maybe next time she sings in the shower, she might not sound so much like a drowning cat. Okay, Hallie, get your coat on, girl. Go to Planet Honey Pop. Okay, sing duet, sing country with our girl Hallie. Come on, Hals. The fuck are you doing? Get out of it. Okay, fun is going up. Social isn't though, but hey, at least we're having fun. Yeah, look at that. Okay. Although we didn't find that that fun because we're still, still low fun. Let's sing another duet. We're just hogging the karaoke machine. Oh, we've just got a little bit better. I can hear a big difference in our voice. We can now carry a tune. Okay, I'm gonna queue up a few interactions as well so we can just get our social need up there. Oh, banter with old friends, yeah. We'll do that while still hogging the karaoke machine so no one else can use it, of course. Oh, finally! Fun and social both going up. And then maybe we'll just grab just a quick snack. Maybe some... Oh, something cheap. Just some olives. Actually, can I not just grab... Yeah, I can grab some chips. Learnt that one when we did our homeless challenge. We never have to pay for food again. I mean, sure, we might always be uncomfortable from having non-nutritious non-balanced meals okay i'm pretty happy with your needs now so let's head home and then we'll get sewing again remember we want to make four pieces today okay so i am thinking we are going to stick to what we know we'll make four pieces that we already know we can make and then maybe tomorrow because if we build up our our sewing skill a little bit more maybe tomorrow we can take a few more risks so I'm going to make two romantic dresses, two toddler dresses. That's a pretty safe bet, I think. I really want to make the lingerie because that sells for the most money. But I haven't had a pop-up yet to say that there's any chance that I'll be successful in making those. So I guess we'll just have to try and build up our skill even more and see how we get on. 
But Jackie, you've had your fun now, all right? Needs are all green. I've done my part. Now it's down to you to do yours. Beautiful. And then maybe we'll queue up a toddler dress to do next. Needs are still pretty good. A little bit peckish, but other than that, good to go. And you've got yourself inspired. Perfect. Do you know what does annoy me slightly with the rental system? And I, I guess I get it, sort of, but it could be so much more efficient. It annoys me that you can't mix lot types. Like, I know that this is a rental, um, but we could have potentially had a tiny home as well. It annoys me that you can't have a tiny home rental. You know what I mean? Seems like there should be a bit of cross-pack compatibility there. Oh no, you fucked up the toddler dress. Oh, Jackie, we had a t we had a task of doing four today. Grab yourself some food. Stop being so hangry and then we'll try again. Oh, your date went well? Oh, good, good. Just call me Cupid. Oh, what now, Hallie? I wanted to ask if I should get to know... All right, I'm not your, like, little phone book. I, d I don't know, just do, do what you want. Call me every time. Get a life, get a hobby, get some friends. Oh, I need to buy some more supplies. That cock up cost us money. Okay, let's get some more fabric. Let's just get more of everything. Hmm, she's still kind of tense, but I'm hoping I'm hoping that while we're sewing, that mood buff will just expire on its own because it's only got like 40 minutes left. I'm determined to do four today. Okay, we did it, even with the tense mood buff. Okay, we just got to do one more and then we've beat our personal best. And it looks like this one's going well. Okay, cool, cool. I wonder if we'll finish the day on five grand. That would be good. Okay, we'll just sell all of these. 350, okay, so that must have been the toddler dress. Another 350, okay. So we're kind of back to where we were at the karaoke bar, three grand. 990, oh, I think we are gonna finish the day on five grand. Okay, and then I'm going to, we'll use the bathroom. And then maybe, maybe we'll just practice a couple of times. Again, just to try and increase our skill a little bit. All right, let's go to bed. There are no books to read on this shelf. I could potentially buy a book. That might give us some fun. Just something easy, like a game of groans. Or maybe, oh, Roadmap to Love. We might enjoy that book. Now we have something that might boost our fun slightly. We'll have some breakfast. Actually, we'll serve breakfast so we can just grab leftovers. Okay, now just go and read something. Yeah. Okay, yeah, that is filling up our fun a lot quicker than playing mobile games does. Not today, Welcome Wagon. Y didn't you guys already come before? And, uh, well, we seem to have made a few enemies, so maybe we'll just put a call in. Build up our social need a little bit. Okay, what could we try and make? Because we want to take, take a few more risks this time. What about the her bathrobe? So we'll draw a feminine bathrobe and see if we can sew that. Okay, can we do it, though? Can we sew it nicely? I guess we'll see. Okay, this is definitely looking promising. Right, I'm gonna sell that straight away because I wanna see how much that's worth. I wanna see if it's worth more than the summer dress because so far that is my money maker. And I reckon that bathrobe use, I reckon that bathrobe uses as much fabric as my romance dress. So let's see. If I sell it on Plopsy, let's see how much we make for this bedtime attire. 9.90, the same, okay. Okay, so we tried something new. What else new could we try? Um, I mean, I could try lingerie. We'll try the Ellie, the Ellie version. There's a high chance that we're gonna fail, but that's fine, I'm taking that gamble. We'll just see how it goes. That looks really nice. Okay, you've got low bladder, so I'm gonna let you go and use the bathroom. And then we'll try that design and see how it goes. Hoping for the best, but expecting the worst. Looking positive so far. At this point, Hallie's just sort of rubbing it in my face now that she's making all these friends. Moving on. Oh no, I think, yeah, okay, we broke it. Oh wait, we didn't. I mean, it doesn't look the best, but it doesn't look awful. Maybe sell on Plopsy, see how much it was worth. I'm, su I'm genuinely surprised we were able to pull that off. How much are we gonna make for that? Oh, I didn't get any money for that. What the fuck? No, I'm not having that. Let's try again. That happened with the fedora as well. It sold and I didn't get any money for it. I don't know whether it's because this mod is slightly older. I don't know. Maybe there are some conflicts with it, maybe. But I am getting paid for most of them, but that's the second time now I've sold something and not made any money. 
But that's not to say that's this mod. I do have loads of mods installed at the moment, so it could be that it's just conflicting with something else in my game. Sewing level six. We can now secure the bag with her sewing skills. Sachet the heaven into that fabric. Okay, great. Okay, so I guess now is a good time to find out whether that glitch happens randomly or whether it's specific to this piece, because if this sells for nothing, then I think we've got our answer. Okay, let's see. Waited with bated breath. The outfit is for a very slim sim. I didn't make any money off it. Oh, damn. I think that maybe that glitch is just with that item then and the fedora. Okay, let's try, let's try designing a few more pieces. So far, we haven't... I don't think we've sold anything yet today, have we? Oh, no, we sold the bathrobe. But that's it. Okay, let's try the wonder and see how we get on. I feel like maybe we're just unlucky today. Maybe today just isn't our day. If we... Okay, we haven't fucked that one up. Okay, if this one sells for nothing, then I'm just going to make, like, four romantic dresses. Let's see, how much is that one going to sell for? If anything at all. And then we'll treat ourselves to a shit. Oh, again, we made nothing. Oh, that's really annoying. At least we have leftovers. Right, you know what? I don't, I don't really want to waste my fabric now, so I'm just going to make some romantic dresses. See where that gets me. At least I know I can do romantic dresses. Oh, that's clever. You're eating your fruit bowl at the same time. If I make four romantic dresses, then I could end the day at 10 grand, and that would be our halfway point, which I would be pretty happy with. This is our specialty now, romantic dresses. All right, now finish your fruit bowl, take a thoughtful shower, and then maybe you can read your little porn book as well that gets you in a flirty mood. Or, or not, or just go to bed, okay, fine. And then maybe we'll put a few phone calls in, we'll try and make amends with our neighbors who hate us. Just apologise. I imagine we probably need to... What have we got? Oh, we got loads of fabric. Oh, okay, that's fine. I was starting to think we didn't have enough materials, but actually we have loads of materials. Okay, I'm going to make... I'm going to get some threads and needles, and I'm going to make some bathrobes. Okay, we'll buy some threads and needles, we'll get leftovers, we'll use the bathroom, and by that point, all of our needs should be very high. Okay, we will do a bathrobe. What else do we have? A his bathrobe, a trench coat outfit, a tuxedo. Oh, I wouldn't mind a wedding dress. And then Alpha CC. The fact that it says try the satin jumpsuit makes me think we need to max out the skill to do that. Not really too bother bothered about accessories. I would like to try this again, but maybe I'll leave it till the last thing we do today so that it doesn't feel like that much of a blow when we don't sell anything. I'm going to make two bathrobes. I'm going to try the wedding dress as well. See how that works out for me. Hallie would like to come over. Yeah, girl, come on over. I'm not doing much. Just trying to desperately salvage what's left of my life after our parents got put away for being a bit naughty. Okay, let's draw a design for a wedding dress. And we'll try our luck. We'll see how we get on. Okay, do we think that we could try it? Do we think we could maybe do a wedding dress? I mean, we kind of need to be good at doing a wedding dress because if Hallie, if Hallie's date went so well, then maybe we could make a wedding dress for her as a gift. Okay, we're now under 5,000, but with what I've got on my clothing rack, I think we'll be fine. We're currently very inspired, so hopefully that plays into my favor. Almost, at, well, not almost, but we're very we're on our way to sewing level seven. Oh, we didn't mess this one up. That's a really nice dress. Maybe we should make Hallie's um, wedding dress for her. Okay, and I think after this, you're overdue on your rent. Oh, God damn it. Guys, I thought you were trying to be nice. I thought you were helping me out. Okay, fine. I'll pay bills and rent. Okay, my inventory now, my clothing rack is so full that I can't physically fit anything else on it so I think that might be a sign that I need to sell all of my creations now so let's just try and sell what we have 990 okay beautiful I wonder if my wedding dress will fit on my rack now there we go yeah I mean you'd think the wedding dress would sell for over a thousand surely all right over the halfway mark over 10k let's see how much the wedding dress sells for hopefully a lot and then we'll come and do a design for maybe the maid. We'll try our luck. 
Oh, that was 9.90 as well. Okay, so basically there's no point in me making gowns if they're going to sell for the same as the romantic dress. I think that's just my safest bet. But maybe we'll try we'll try the bedtime wear again. I am starting to think maybe there's just a glitch with this fashion type in general. So, we're going to make it and anticipate that we might not get any money for it. That is, even if we can make it, we might not even be a high enough skill level. Okay, moment of truth. I mean, it doesn't look like we've made it that well. I wonder if the quality is the reason why I don't make any money when I sell it. I don't know. Could that have something to do with it? Could it be like a purpose thing? Actually, no, it can't be because the fedora was just fine. No money. Okay, fine, fine. I'm gonna stock up supplies and then I'm gonna make, um, I'm gonna make two bathrobes, two dresses. Oh, we are pretty tense though. Maybe it's not the best idea to sew while I'm tense. Okay, let's go read our, our little sexy novel again. And then you can grab leftovers, use the bathroom, and then we'll, we'll call it a night. We'll go to bed. I've kind of lost track of how many days we've been doing this. Is this what, day four now or day five? Okay, let's do some more sewing. Do you know what I would love? If this mod got updated, I would love it if it played into the fame system as well. If you could gain fame from being like a clothing designer and you could sell clothes, instead of selling them on Plopsy, if you could sell them to like stores, that would be pretty cool. Level seven. Okay, I'm gonna try the L again because I want to see if like what the quality comes out because the last time I did it was like two skill levels ago and it kind of looked a bit frayed so I guess we'll try it again and see how how it works out okay it kind of looks the same as before which makes me think maybe we're not really that good at making like sleepwear oh no we've got a water leak actually that might help me I might make some money from fixing this Just try and be creative just mop up all these puddles I don't think I've had this one before in my rental units. I don't think I've had a water leak yet. But you know, these are the life skills that we need, Jackie. Especially if we're gonna make it out on our own. We won't have Hallie's parents to call on anytime something goes wrong, so it's probably good that we learn this now. Life skills. Okay, we've got 120 simoleons. Yeah, good. Yeah, I should think so too. I don't really care if this unit rating goes up. In fact, if anything, for me it's better if it stays low because then my landlord can't charge me more. My landlord, who was supposed to be a family friend doing me a favor, still bleeding me dry. Okay, I think let's sell what we have. I reckon we'll, we'll end on like 1,500, 15,000, sorry. We might even be able to move out before the weekend. We could have Hallie over. I don't know what we should make her. I don't think we should make her underwear because we're not very good at making underwear. And she doesn't actually have a boyfriend. She just, I think we might be jumping the gun if we just give her a wedding dress after one successful date. So I think maybe the fedora is a good way to go. Maybe we'll make her a nice little fedora. Oh, we're almost at 15,000, three quarters of the way there. But will the lingerie be worth anything or will it be worth fuck all? I'm gonna try it on and see what it looks like. See, I think it looks, it looks amazing. A little bit frayed at the sides, but Okay, let's change back into our normal clothes. Oh. I don't actually know whatever what happened to that lingerie. I'm guessing it's gone forever now. No, I still have it. Um, can I like put it back on the shelf though? How can I put it back on the shelf? Maybe I could sew casuals. We haven't done that one yet. Um, draw casual patterns. I think we'll be more than qualified to take on casuals. Oh, it'd be nice to get out of this shit hole have a place of our own, invite Hallie over, she can come stay with us. I mean, she can't live with us because it's only one bedroom, but she could hang out with us. Okay, how much is that worth? I'm gonna guess that's worth only like 500. I don't think that's gonna be worth that much, but I could be wrong. How are my supplies looking? Only five units. Oh, that was 540. Oh, okay, I was pretty close there. Only five units of fabric, okay. So I'll buy some more fabric and I think I might be good on all other materials. We'll buy some fabric. We'll make um, another wedding dress. We'll make another gown. Reminds me of the Sims 2 wedding dress. Okay, needs aren't too great. And it's currently the middle of the night. I'm thinking maybe if we just, if we fill your needs and then maybe we'll see if Hallie wants to hang out. Maybe we'll go for lunch or something. 
Maybe we'll go hang out somewhere or something. That's right, read your little book. She's always happy when she reads her little filthy novels. She's wearing that outfit we sewed to bed. I guess that's just her sleepwear now. Feeling a bit lonely. Maybe we'll just go to Hallie's house because we haven't really spent any time there. Maybe let's just go visit Unit. Oh, there she is. Okay, I know you're feeling lonely. <laughs> so I think we should just go in for a hug. Sometimes that's all you need, just a little bit of physical contact. Deep conversation. Share secret. Look at that social need going straight up. Um, so this is Hallie's house. That's her dad, Brian. This is Hallie's room. Although it looks like Hallie's mum doesn't really understand privacy. Hallie, maybe you should just move in with me. Okay, I think our social need is full enough. I think we're we're in a pretty good mood. Let's head home, because we still have two items to sell. We've got our wedding dress and our ball gown. And then, you know what? I think we might only be a few pieces away from moving out of this basement and getting a place of our own. I think we're pretty close. I'm gonna sell these two on Plopsy. I think that'll take us to about 18 grand. So it could only be two or three more pieces. So I'm gonna queue up a romantic dress. Beautiful. I hope no one's moved into the house I already built. I didn't really think about that. Hopefully no one has. Yeah, okay, so what we'll do is we'll make another bathrobe and I think that will be enough to be able to move out, finally. What skill, what skill level are we? Six and a half. That's all it took. Okay, sell on Plopsy. Yes. Ah, oh, we made it. Over 20k, right. Fuck the notice period. We're gonna move household, even though it costs 500 simoleons. What a joke. And I guess we'll just see what, what we have left to furnish a place of our own. Our parents would be so proud. We're standing on our own two feet and we didn't have to lie, cheat or steal to do it. Pretty sure this is the house. I think it was like 12 grand, something like that. So yeah, we are gonna be getting very basic furniture. Oh, look who came with me. Yeah, so this is our house. It's nothing, you know, spectacular. It's quite small, but it's, you know, cozy. It's all the space we need. We've got a built-in kitchen, a bathroom. So all we, we really need is like some living room and bedroom furniture. So let's see how far our money stretches. Although it looks like we didn't spend that much. How have I got 17,000 simoleons? I thought I'd be left with like five grand. That doesn't seem to make any sense. Maybe my game is just broken completely beyond repair. But I'm sure this lot was, yeah, 12,250. So we shouldn't have that much money. We should have, I'm trying to work out. Right, let's just call it seven grand because we had to pay the um, the fee as well for breaking our our lease or something like that. Yeah, my game is very broken today. <laughs> okay, we're just gonna get very basic, very basic things just to see if we can furnish our home with it. We might do a part two at a later date where we can sort of see if we can up our game a little bit with our furniture and things like that, but for now, we're just gonna make do with what we have. It may not be the kind of luxury that we're used to, but better than living in our friend's basement. I'm not really overly conscious of style right now. I'm mainly just trying to make sure we have like, just the, some of the stuff we need. I mean, I would like to get a double bed, but it depends how expensive they are. Ah, oh, that one's not too bad. 300 simoleons, we can, we can live with that. I feel like maybe I'm just not even spending enough because I still have quite a lot of money left over and I've almost bought everything we need, but that's okay, we can use that money for supplies. Okay, I could even get, I wasn't even sure if I'd be able to fit a dining table in here, but I'm thinking I might be able to. Maybe just a little small one. Well, I think in terms of like the stuff we need, we've pretty much got everything. I might just get some curtains, but we've got pretty much everything we need. So I could get some like activity focused stuff. Some like skill building items or something. Obviously we need a bookcase so we can read our filth. A bit dark in, in this corner over here. Maybe we'll get a little lamp. So I feel like we need something on the wall here. Maybe something on this wall. There we go. You know what? It's not much this place, but it is ours. It's a place of our own. And we even have some money left over for a few more sewing materials. 
Jackie, I think you should be very proud of yourself as to where you started and where you are now. And on that note, I think I'm going to end this video here. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please like and subscribe. You know I love it when you do that. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.